Hi, this is John Morgan with the latest video tip for 2020 design. Color matching via the eyedropper. The eyedropper is great for making a perspective in the actual tones and colors of the paints that you're going to use. You'll see that my far, far wall is a lovely shade of gray right now. Well, we're going to change that. Let me take my floor plan. I'm going to drag this over to the left and snap it into place. And on the right, you're going to notice I am already in Pharaoh and Ball's website. So I can double click on a wall. Now I already know that the walls in that living space are walls 1, 4, 5, and 10. I held the control key down and I clicked on each of those walls. Now I can go to material. And right here where it says finish, I am going to click on the browse button. When I click on the browse button, my texture screen appears. If I go into user texture, which is the third option, this will show me all of the textures that I have already loaded into my system. Now if you look over here, this is the Pharaoh and Ball actual paint collection. So I can scroll down and find a paint that I would like to use. Let's go down to a blue. So let's say that we find uh, Cook's Blue. If I go back over to my 2020 texture menu, there's an eyedropper. And I drag it over to Cook's Blue and let it go, it copied that color right into 2020. Matter of fact, I can go in and name it. I can call this Cook's Blue. We can go down here, give it a description, give it a color name. I can even come in and change whether it's glossy or flat or such. If I click OK, and I click OK again, let's go take a look at our perspective. You'll notice that the wall in the living space is now Pharaoh and Ball Cook's Blue. For other great ideas, tips, and inspiration, please join us at 2020spaces.com forward slash community.